Ah, uh, check this out. A rare sight tonight for stargazers. You're going to have to take a peek at this. Yeah. Mars tonight will be the closest it's been to Earth in over a decade. Red planet will be visible to the naked eye. Yeah, and that has many people, of course, flocking to the Griffith Observatory mm -hmm. for a watch party. Tonight, Cake Online's Brittany Hopper is there live where all the excitement is building. Hi, Brittany. Hey guys, this is so exciting. Just look at how many people are out here. This is so cool. All you need to do is just go outside right now. Well, not right now. After our newscast, go outside and just look up. There's Jupiter and there's Venus. A watch party at Griffith Observatory brought out dozens of people, even a special guest, astronaut Buzz Aldrin. As the planet Mars will be at its closest approach to Earth, since August 2003. I think every child, every adult should look up and just be curious and be excited about uh, what's out there. And what's out there right now? Well, Mars is at an historic distance from Earth, only 35.8 million miles away. It's really fun. And while people were having fun looking at the stars, a Hollywood star was amongst us. Actor Tim Russ, who was on Star Trek Voyager for seven years, brought his professional telescope as astronomy has become his hobby over the years, even well before he played a character flying through space. Uh, it's coincidental that I ended up working on that show. It could have just as easily as been Baywatch at the time, but it was, it was that show. And uh, I was already very much enamored with uh, space science way before that.